Hey, good morning, YouTube. How you guys doing? Hope you guys are having a good Tuesday. So today we're back at our uh, second job that we looked at the other day. It was this deck removal job. So let me swing you around. All right, I made a blunder. So the customer did call me the other day and told me he had uh, not only the deck and everything that we looked at originally, but he also had some yard waste. So when I quoted the job, I was confusing it with this other deck removal job that we went to go look at for some reason. And uh, I stuck to my original price on this, on this job, but I did come off a little, uh, just because I said I would try to be a man of my word, so. But that was me thinking it was just the deck. But we also have this yard waste, so we're gonna still go ahead and take care of it. Just gonna suck it up and move on, but here's what we got, so. Looks like the customer was doing some yard waste, or uh, some yard work, and has a bunch of yard waste. And it looks like um, some other trash in here too. And we got the deck, so we're gonna try to actually salvage uh, this wood, the decking, and try to use it on a little trailer we got, uh, and then everything else. We'll just take to the landfill, so it shouldn't be too hard, but uh, sometimes you make mistakes, but you gotta live and learn and press through it. Oh, but that's okay, it's only the first mistake I've made, so not too bad. All right, so we're gonna get started here. Got the goal. All right, so we got all the yard waste off. Well, most of it. This is getting my OCD kicking in. You can see here, got it all loaded in the van. So not much really, but it took maybe 10 minutes. So I wanted to get all that done before we did the wood so that when we throw the all the wood in, we'll just push down all the uh, yard debris, maximizing our space because we want to work efficiently, right? That's the name of the game, work smarter, not harder. So I won't need my blue tarp for this one. Just a little bit of sweat and elbow grease to really get it done, but I'm trying to figure out which of these boards I want to salvage for the trailer to redo the flooring on it. So I guess I'm gonna go with these middle sections here. Uh, I might try to salvage uh, some of these if I can. So what I'm gonna do is I'll take off the outer part, which I kind of started to already here. There was a post. Uh, throw that in the van, and then try to figure out what part of this uh, the stairs that I want to keep, and then throw in everything else. Pretty straightforward. But we were able to hook up our saw up there to the house. All right, wasn't too far. And there's their new deck. You can see it right there. So they just took this whole deck and this one big piece, I guess, and brought it down from the house down here and just left it. So I guess, you know, that's one way to remove it. So we're gonna go ahead and continue on, but just thought I'd give you guys a quick little update. All right, so here's where we're at so far. Like I showed you earlier, we got all the yard waste done. And here's what we got in the van. All right, tried to get all the big pieces first all the trash because it looks like whoever did this deck I don't know how many of them there were but looks like they had a lot of downtime all this trash and food there's a bunch more buried under there but and in here so uh, so we're gonna improvise instead of picking up all these little pieces by hand we're just gonna use this little piece of wood try not to step on a nail and push it closer to the vehicle all right we want to work smarter not harder and then when my help gets here i'll make him do all this while i do all the cutting so when you're on the job sometimes you got to think outside the box a little bit try to get things done in a timely and efficient manner but starting to sweat starting to get in my eyes it's getting so hot out all right we're well, back to work I'll show you guys the end result here in just a minute all right just kidding 
we're not leaving just yet so we have this little pile i just pushed so instead of walking it we're just gonna throw it i don't got time to wait for the help today i want to get this done because we've got a jukebox to go look at from that other job i told her i'd come back and look at it i was so busy with other jobs that i couldn't do it that day so instead of waiting for the help let's just keep throwing it in here making all these shots you think i'm kobe okay i just thought i was gonna miss that one because i said that but all right we're gonna get moving I can do a lot go a lot quicker if I put the camera down so unfortunately I'm tired of making all these shots you guys are gonna have to stop watching I know some of you might be getting a little jealous of how good I am no I'm just gonna try to be humble I'm not that cocky uh, I believe you gotta be humble if not you'll be humbled in this business just in life in general so no I'm blessed to be able to do this and make the money that I do make so all right I'll show you guys what we're doing here in just a minute but let me finish this up We are all done. We got all the wood picked up. No trash left behind. Work site cleaned up. Everything looking better than it did before. No more shed. Just gotta throw these few little pieces of board on the trailer that we have. And that will be it. So another happy customer served. Why none other than cracking junk removal.